Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the another video. And I'm using iOS 17.5 beta 1. And in this video, I want to talk about the battery life. I want to talk about the charging tips that I'm going to give you through which you can improve the battery life. You can improve the battery health of your iPhone. Well, before that, I want to talk about a very weird situation happening on this phone. So I, I updated to the 17.5 beta 1 and my phone was around 98 percent on the battery has it's been a two weeks i'm using this version almost and it dropped to 95 percent as you can see now the reasons could be doing geekbench test again and again because whenever you do a geekbench test it uses all the resources of your phone and that leads to getting your phone warm so that can be one reason also cod warzone came out a couple of weeks ago so i was playing that game and that game is not well optimized so that was also you know warming up my iphone so these two could be reasons or maybe beta could be reason for the three percent drop in the battery health but i'm not happy with this so i'm here with uh, the some of the charging tips that you can apply to slow down the battery health drop or to get a better battery life so what you need to do is guys you need to keep your phone from 20 to 80 percent always if your phone is around 20 percent just plug in charger start charging your phone and whenever your phone reaches 80 percent plug out the charger stop charging it this is the best technique that can help to you know improve or you know slow down the degrees of battery health and make your battery much better for a very long time so this is the best technique that you can apply i always apply this i try to keep my phone more than 20 percent and if ever my phone drops below 20 percent i stop using it even i'm not at home or i'm out somewhere i just stop using it i'm always start using it once i charge it to the 80 or 85 percent this is a really good technique that can help to improve the battery life and also it can help to slow down the degrees of battery health which is going to be really good the second technique i want to talk about is quite simple always use original accessories no matter what if you are out at your friend place or at either place you don't have original accessories simply don't charge don't charge your iphone always use you know apple certified original accessories for charging your iphone that can also help uh, you to get a much better battery life now the third thing i want to talk about will be quite weird for most of the people out there and that is about the electricity unstability or stability in many locations electricity electricity stability is the problem and that is like maybe you're not getting proper a volt out of your electricity and that electricity fluctuations can also affect the battery health of your iphone so there are different devices available in the market known as electricity stabilizers you can install those uh, devices in your home and charge your phone through those devices that will help to avoid electricity fluctuations and that will definitely improve the battery health and the battery life of your iphone so these were some of the charging tips that you can apply to improve the battery life you guys know me i always try to keep videos straight and simple that's why most of the time my videos are quite small but i'm here to help you guys in any way possible well, if you have any other charging tip, let me know in the comment section below for the other people. And if you like this video, make sure to subscribe. And I will see you in my next in my next video. Until that, take care. Peace out.